Hi guys, today we're going to be looking at a ground floor apartment on Las Terrazas de la Torre. This one is a south southeast orientation. Um, this one's just come back on. There hasn't been any grounds available for quite a while. Um, so anyone that's looking for a ground, this one's literally just come on. I don't expect it to be on for long. So if you're interested, certainly come back to us sooner rather than later. Um, I'm just going to start you off on the roof solarium as always here. This block has been painted. We're on the first horseshoe as well here, so very close to the town centre. I'm going to quickly show you this area here. So this area is communal. You can see you've got an area to dry your clothes there. Someone's uh, using a barbecue up here as well. So it's a bit windy up here. You always catch the breeze when you're up on the roof. And you've got this area here as well, just to show you. And then just down here, you've got the swimming pool. And the apartment we're going to be looking at is actually to the left of the block. So it's essentially the ground floor on this side, so the one kind of right at the bottom to the left of the block. So I'm just going to make my way back down towards um, the ground floor and show you the property here. Um, just as we're going down, just to remind you again, so this is on the first horseshoe, so just a few minutes walk to the bar, um, to the supermarket, to the golf clubhouse as well. Um, so very easy just to walk down, don't need a car, walk down in a couple of minutes. So I'm just going to jump in the lift here on the third floor down to the ground and then I'll catch you back on the ground floor. Okay, right, so here we are on the ground floor, so just come out of the lift here, that's the entrance into the block. You've got two, oh, sorry, so the lights are all made there, they just get off. That's two apartments on that side and then you have two on the left side. We're just going to be looking at the far corner. So as we come into the apartment, you're probably quite familiar with this layout. It's a corner, uh, left-hand side corner layout. Just behind the door, you've got the fuse box, the entry phone system, and then you've got the multimedia box just down there as well. Kitchen to the left of us. Let's just have a quick look at the kitchen area. Space here for your fridge freezer with the cupboard just above it. You've got your oven, your hob, your extractor, and also your boiler will just be in place here as well. There's nice windows there, just letting loads of light. It's quite nice actually, quite pleasant. Just looks out to the green area. Windows need a bit of a clean. And then just under the counter here, you have the space for your washing machine and your dishwasher. Going into the uh, reception area, nice large reception, nice big double doors out to the terrace, which we'll look at last. Then you've got this another window here, just a bit of a dual aspect, lots of light coming in to the other side of the uh, reception as well. Light fitting just above that by the window, it's kind of set up for a dining table. Of course, doesn't mean you have to put a dining table, but it has been kind of set up for that. With the sofa going on this wall here. And then looking back, opposite us, you've got the TV points down here. And you've also got the pre-installation for the air conditioning cap, which is just here. If we go back towards where the double doors are, looking back towards the kitchen, you'll see all the full ceiling area there as well. Um, so very easy to put any kind of lighting in there. A lot of people go for the spotlights, um, cheap and easy to fit. Um, as I say, it just helps having that full ceiling as well. All of the windows, all of the doors have shutters, of course. Uh, just to let you know while we're walking around. As we go back towards the back of the uh, property, so that kitchen that we looked at, got this little corridor on the left, you've got the bathroom. All as you'd expect, bathroom, bidet, toilet, three quarter bath, and then just above you've got the shower there as well and the mixer tap. Out of the bathroom, and if we go straight up, we go straight into the guest bedroom. So bedside table in the centre there where the lights are, two single beds each side, TV points just over here and below the window. Window just looks out to the front of the block there, just where the parking is really. Then you've got your top of wardrobe here, shelving put in and clothes rail already in place as well. Good size room this, easily get a double in if you'd rather a double than two uh, singles. And then just above the door there, again you can see the pre-installation of the air conditioning. So a really good size room. So we come out of the guest, we do a quick right straight into the master. And this has been set up for a double or a king. Uh, again, you can just tell really from where the, the fixtures are for the light fittings, the bedside tables, 
and double over king in the center. Looks out the same way as that guest, so just to the front of the block. And then you've got your TV points just down here towards the foot of the bed. The double wardrobe is the same as the guest bedroom with your rails already in place and your shelving already in place. Pre-insulation for the air conditioning just above the door, you can see the cap there. Again, good size room. So we'll just have a quick recap as we go out towards the terrace. So out of the master bedroom, to the left of the master is the guest bedroom. Then you've got this little corridor with the kitchen to the left. Bathroom opposite to the right. Main door that we came in just on the right hand side here. This nice big open plan reception. This nice big double doors which go out to an extended terrace. South southeast this one, it's actually about 1.30 almost in the afternoon, so still plenty of sun. We've been getting it from first thing this morning. You've got lots of sun on the end part and you can see it's just half covered and then half open. Electric points to the right and not with water points. But yeah, nice good size terrace area. I'm just going to walk you towards the pool area um, to show you where it is but I think there's people in the pool so I'm not going to film too close to it but I'll just walk you down because it sits right onto the pool area and you've got a little path as you can see I'm just walking along. And you can see the pool area is just in front of us here. So this is just your pool area, so just a couple of uh, couple of seconds walk really, and then the apartment is just back here. So I zoomed out a little bit there as we uh, went towards the pool, so it might have actually looked a bit further than it was. So then as we go back, of course, it's that end apartment. Just there, behind that tree. Any questions, please come back to the office. Thank you.